to have all of you here today for the webinar on PR as a managerial skill. This is after a long time that we are meeting on the online platform for a webinar. I am very pleased to introduce our resource person for today, Shri Kashyap Joshipura Sir. Shri Kashyap Joshipura Sir is a retired chief manager corporate communications from ONGC Limited, Assam Asset. He has worked in various organizations, including the Gujarat Samachar. He had also served as the city PRO in Rajkot Municipal Corporation. He used to work at various organizations. He is a life member of the Advertising Club of Mumbai. He is also a life member at Assam Sahitya Sabha, Public Relations Society of India, and Gujarat Media Club. Sri Joshipura sir has a very wide experience of interacting with students on various aspects of PR. We are very glad to have you, sir. And I personally, and on behalf of the Argocom fraternity, welcome you, sir, to today's webinar. I must extend my heartfelt gratitude to Professor Debobrata Das, sir, our Honorable Vice Chancellor, who has kindly consented to inaugurate the webinar on his behalf. With this, I hand over the session to Professor Debobrata Das, sir, and declare the webinar open and deliver a few words before we start and hand over to our resource person. Thank you, Dr. Asila. Uh, am I audible? Yes, sir, you are audible. So, uh, esteemed resource person of this session, uh, Mr. Kashyap Josipura, coordinator of this evening, Dr. Rashida Morain, dear faculty members and the participants. This is a real uh, pleasure for me to inaugurate this function. And uh, this is the first function after my joining the Assam Rajiv Gandhi University of Cooperative Management. First of all, I would like to welcome Mr. Kashyap Josipura who in fact I am told that has been kindly conferred for a long time. He has been contributing for the development of the academic uh, environment of this university for a long time, addressing the students and his scholars from time to time. I have also known from the sources that he has a great contribution towards the uh, public relations and also societal uh, relations in the Sipsagar town and uh, entire Assam for that matter. So I personally welcome and I also on behalf of the uh, Assam Rajiv Gandhi University of Cooperative Management welcome Mr. Kaisam Sosipura to this uh, evening webinar as a resource person. We hope that you will keep on uh, showering your blessings to our students and be connected with us for long time, for next, you know, maybe, uh, you know, time uh, from different occasion to occasion. Uh, dear uh, participants, PR as a managerial skill is a very relevant topic, not only for the manager, but for any executives or any person per se, be it in entrepreneurship, Field, be it in communicate, you need to connect with your students. If you cannot connect, if you cannot, you know, communicate properly, whatever knowledge you have, you cannot transfer your knowledge to the students. Similarly, if you are a manager, you have to connect with different parties, different stakeholders. You have your fellow. Uh, competitors, you have to com com uh, communicate with them, you have community at large, you have to communicate with them, you have media persons, you have to call them, you have internal different stakeholders like employee association and, uh, you know, and the officers association, you have 
your creditors, you have your public in general. So different people you will face at different times that you have to communicate. So connecting with them by proper communication is very important and crucial irrespective of the field that you are working in. So the communication is not only is required for uh, uh, changing or communicating your thought in one way, but it is a two ways communication, then it becomes a successful PR. So if the other side people also communicate with you and you also communicate with them, and in the next stage of this communication will lead to the building of relationships. So that relationship with different stakeholders that I have already talked about is crucial. Once you build up the relationship with different stakeholders, you are going to make a sustainable affairs of your business or your organization or your profession, whatever you are doing or wherever you are there. So building up of a relationship with different stakeholders is very important and for that, you need first to have a successful communication. And this successful communication will come for, from the skill of PR. Hence, this topic has been selected you know, very rightly and very aptly by the organizers. So I must congratulate the organizers, Dr. Rashida and uh, her team for selecting this. And for students, I must say that this is a topic you are getting outside the classroom, you should build up, you should, you know, try to imbibe it in your personality as a deliverable skill. And I'm sure with the uh, resource person with, uh, you know, so much of experience and exposure, you will get a lot of things to learn from him. With this, I would like to uh, invite again uh, a resource, uh, resource person, Dr. Mr. Kaishab uh, Jashikura, to this webinar. And I thank my uh, participants for uh, attending here. And I also thank the organizers for giving me the opportunity to address the veteran. Thank you so much. Wish this webinar will be a successful one. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Sir, your words have actually set the right platform for today's webinar. I'm so grateful to you, sir. Before we proceed and I hand over the session to Sri Kashyap Josipura, sir. Pritam, the moderator, can you please have any modalities of how we proceed? Can we have, can you detail out on that regarding the question answer session? Uh, yes, ma'am. Now, Sri Kashyap Josipura, sir, will continue the session. And we can have our Q&A at the end of the session. And uh, students and the faculty members can put up uh, their questions through chat box. And our, our respected speaker, sir, will answer them accordingly. Thank you so much, Pritam. I now invite Sri Kashyap Joshipura, sir, for delivering the session. Namaskar. Mr. Sabna, I have told you a lot of things that I have told you. कि जिनके लिए मैं बोलने वाला था तो थैंक यू वेरी मच दास सब यू है एक्सप्लेन्ड एप्लाइड पब्लिक रिलेशंस सो आई मस्ट बी थैंकफुल टू यू रसिदा मैडम प्रीतम मिश्रा जी वाइस चांसलर सर फैकल्टी मेंबर्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर इनवाइटिंग मी फॉर दिस सेशन फॉर दिस इंटेलेक्चुअल गैदरिंग एंड I must congratulate entire team of the university for organizing such intellectual gathering. Sir, I used to visit your university since 2014 when our Mr. D.K. Barua was executive director and your predecessor was his friend. So he has suggested uh, to have something on public lessons. So I used to visit. And thank you very much for inviting me for this thing. Now we will straight go to the subject. We will not spare much time on this. Uh, I am audible to you all. Am I? Audible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You are audible. Okay. I may not be visible particularly. <laughs> I don't know how to adjust it. 
ओके 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 सो वी आर नॉट टॉकिंग अबाउट मैनेजर वी आर नॉट टॉकिंग अबाउट पब्लिक रिलेशन एज ए स्पेशलाइज सब्जेक्ट वी आर टॉकिंग एज दास करेक्टली मैंशन इट वेर एवर यू आर वेर एवर you may become manager you may not become manager but public relations is a thing which you can use it whenever you are whenever you want to use it we are covering pr skill as a generalized skill it is i am not covering public relations as a specialized skill like financial public relations Uh, health public relations uh, medical public relations educational public relations i am not talking about that thing i am also not talking about specialized managerial skill like mines manager uh, like uh, railway managers like logistic managers like uh, health managers we are talking about generalized thing which our students can utilize it wherever wherever they want to go wherever they want to apply that public relations skill pr skill is to manage the things properly public relations teaches us that things should be managed properly means whenever you use public relations a practice wherever you are using it means you are using it in a such a way that you manage the things and whoever is the participant of that management whether he is your uh, enemy or whether he is your partner all person will think that they won the battle that is the way of public relations managing the things in a public relations way we are still in what to wait for and guide for anybody it means of course you may get good guidance you may not get good guidance you may not get good encouragement you may not get good encouragement but as a public relations person as a man as a pr skill in a managerial work you should not wait for anybody to take decision of course immediate decision require your own capability not others guidance not others uh, support first of all you have to take decision and of course support guidance will definitely follow the matter means good public relations person applied in managerial skill means he takes immediate crisis management decision to solve the things to manage the work pr skill means performing any professional duty any professional duty please don't become unfriendly to anyone you may have many crisis situation you may have to manage many many things but during that performance of work you should not become unfriendly to anyone he may be junior most person he may be the senior most person he may be middle management person or he may not be useful to you at all at all but you should be very friendly to everybody and if you don't do any friendly work but don't become unfriendly to anybody if you want to become good manager don't un become unfriendly to anybody pr skill pr skill means qualities wherever you perform the work or any managing anything to be managed you should maintain best quality it is not the pr thing means you are performing as per the applying your creativity 
it is not the matter that whatever guidelines are there you are following that guidelines and you perform that job and forget it no wherever pr pr person is involved whenever public relations is involved in managerial skill it should reflect in the performance in the work in the result whatever it is and uh, by the way one thing tasab has uh, mentioned it is a two way communications i will just i just come across the thing two way communications public relations is not a one way communications it is a two way communications and whenever you apply two way communications you can manage the thing very properly very correctly and speedily and in favor to all so it is a not only two way it is a multi way communications suppose i will just give you one example when you are passing through some highway or some uh, traffic signal you must be seeing green light red light yellow light that lights are conveying you something means one individual is managing the traffic from his chamber by applying this red green and yellow signals means it is a multi way communication red signal green signal and yellow signal another example it is a practical example you can just see it if you passing through your uh, kaziranga to guwahati you must have observed yellow la yellow strip then white strip on the highway two strip continuous strip on the highway it indicates that don't overtake if you want to overtake please take care or you can overtake these three things they are conveying it by strip so that is communications one individual is avoiding accident by conveying this message to the passer by so this is a multi way communications this is also pr skill means individual is not there to manage the traffic but he has conveyed in a sign language that you should follow this pattern pr skill is useful to individual without being officially designated as a public relations person like your university misra ji is moderating the thing and many other people are participating in the matter in this uh, our uh, intellectual gathering but whenever a public relations person is there if any problem arises you should not wait for moderator to control that thing if any software problem arises anybody any person of our gathering can take charge of the solution of that software uh, crisis so that is the requirement of the pr person you he, he should not be designated manager he may not be designated moderator he may not be designated coordinator but if crisis comes anyone anyone from the gathering can lead the thing and they can diffuse the crisis pr skill individual presence can enhance the value of the gathering you can see the gathering any gathering it is our gathering if an a person is this this is a structured gathering wherever unstructured gathering then no one is leader of no one no one is follower of no one everyone is follower of everyone everyone is leader of everyone so in that case 
if a peer person is there, he can just lead the gathering in a such a way that it can apply its energy in a right direction. So peer person will not wait for anybody. PR person will lead the thing where no leader are, leaders are available and he can apply the thing in a such a way that crowd can be satisfied and crowd can become a group. Group is a collective energy. Crowd is not collective energy. It is a haphazard energy. So if a PR person is there, he can apply that is PR category, PR capability, PR efficiency in a such a way that that crowd can become group and the energy of the group can be useful to the organization. PR skill means judicious approach. It is a judicious approach. If I am having fast today, and you are not having fast today. In that case, I must not behave in a such a way that I am having fast and I should not bother about your food. And if you people are having fast and some group of people are not having fast, this fight and people will not come in that picture that who bothers for their food, forget about that thing. And if I am having food and you may not have food, but I must have my judicious approach that whatever he may have fast, I must organize for the food for the fast. I am not having fast, I must organize in a such a way that whoever my fellow colleagues are there, who are not having fast, they will take food accordingly. You should be judicious. PR is not the thing that he should have favor favorable to this, unfavorable to this. No. Public relations is a judicious profession where you should take judicious decisions in larger interest of the society, larger interest of the nation, larger interest of the human being. So that is the PR quality. If a manager performs in a favorable or unfavorable way, naturally organization will suffer. Naturally, people will suffer. People may become unfriendly to the manager. People may become more friendly to the manager more friendly to the manager that is also not good for the organization more unfriendly to the manager it is also not good for the organization so peer skill means judicious approach to the activities peer things means you should understand the hidden digital language hidden sign language, hidden open language. If our VC sahab went to the Sachivalay or Mantralay or Secretariat at Gavati, and if he accompanies with his public relations profession, professional, he, VC sahab may not be aware of the hidden digital or sign language of any particular watchman, uh, say clerk or anybody because of his assignment of a big job. But as a public relations person, your eyes and ears must be opened must be and your trikal eye must be open this this third eye to analyze the thing available in that particular environment where VC Saab went for some official visit and as a public relations manager or as a manager with public relations skill 
he should inform favorable and unfavorable environment available at that particular moment it may not be there after 5 minutes it might not have been there before 5 minutes but on that particular moment that particular environment is there and public relations profession is supposed to analyze that language that hidden language that sign language that digital language which can be analyzed in favor of the organization so that is another quality of the manager wherever manager may not be a public relations manager manager may be a logistic manager but he is if he or she is having this skill of identifying the hidden language he will be successful in the organization and his or her organization may be successful in their endeavor and their productivity it will enhance that productivity also and public relations skill means you must be positive to negative aspect also you must be sympathetic to the grievances of anyone he may be passer by he may be with your organization he may be your assistant he may be your senior he may not be connected at all but you should be sympathetic to the grievances to the language to the any action of his or her in a sympathetic way in a positive way it may be possible that tomorrow that same individual may be useful to you tomorrow you that maybe that individual may be useful to your organization so you should be sympathetic to all whether it is your interest whether it is may not be interest whether that person is enemy of you or whether it that person is friend of you you should be sympathetic to any individual here thing means healthy attitude what is healthy attitude healthy attitude means if i am not in a position to perform with the university or with the organization or with the task because of my abnormal health i must be frank enough that i may not be able to perform the best way because if as a manager if he is as a peer skill if a public relations person is lethargic if a public relations person is negative if a public relations person is not sympathetic not aggressive to anyone he will spoil entire atmosphere entire and enthusiasm of the group enthusiastic young people uh, to who are very eager to perform their jobs but one individual is not performing their his job her job properly and he is a negative thing because maybe he may be tomorrow he may or she may be be positive yesterday he or she might be positive but today because of her health because of his health he is not positive then he will spoil the positivity encouragement and entire mahol into a discouraging factor so if a pr person is a pr skill that you should be ever ready 24 by 7 12 months of the year any time you may not be able to sustain if you are not positive if you are not ready to do right now right now means right now the public relations thing will not wait for tomorrow public relations crisis will not wait for yesterday 
will not perform day after tomorrow. It is a matter of right and write it right now. So that is the thing. Healthy environment is a must. Health is a must. Public relations profession must be very careful for the health of self. Because if you don't perform properly, it will directly affect your organization. If I don't receive your phone properly, I don't receive anyone's phone, any media's phone properly, media will speak about not me, but about the organization. So fit, fitness is a must. Health is a must for the public relations profession. And any manager, if you don't fit, don't perform, don't come to the task. You forget it about task. You wait for the task. You take rest for half an hour, for one hour. Don't or exceed you for the job which may not which you may not be able to do. And by that you may uh, provide bad information, bad image to the of the company to the outside persons. So that is health is a must for any public relations profession, for any uh, managerial skill we can say. PR is a uh, good managerial skill that if you per manager want to perform, he must have good health, good public relations thing. PR skill means involve other individual, even it does not require as that individual can become your advocate in future. One minute. Public relations thing means you have to involve everybody. Once you enter the job market, you have to, you cannot have prejudice towards one individual. You may not have favor to one individual. Because if you don't involve all, some disgruntled animal may try to spoil your achievement and if you involve everyone in a good task in a good way in a best performance then some of them yeah some of someone from that group of people whom you had worked together whom you were working under them whom you were boss of them. They will become your advocate. Even if your failure somewhere, it is a failure is a part of the game. It is a any human being can may fail in some job. Any human being may get best performance. Any human being may go into trouble. So in that case, that Disgruntled animal, disgruntled individual, we can use animal also, we are all animal. Disgruntled individual will spoil your unsuccessful attempt in a multiple unsuccessful attempt. If you engage everyone, if you have satisfied everyone, if you have involved everyone, don't no need of satisfied. If you have involved everyone in your task, your unsuccessful matter will not be multiplied. Your successful matter may be multiplied by your opinion maker. So today's our friends, today's our unfriends, they are all opinion maker for tomorrow. They were all opinion maker for yesterday. So involve everyone. Whether he may be useful to you, he may not be useful to you. But as a public relations person, 
you should involve each and every individual of your organization in your task in your activities and if you are a passerby if you are have a problem in your traffic signal with your scooter you should involve policemen at the same time common public that common public and policemen may be successful in solving your problem if you if you are egoistic and if you don't consider anybody's presence available in that area then people will say that this fellow is supposed to do like that only he should suffer more so that is a public relations tactics you should involve everybody he ask him in individual even if he ask him in not to disconnect any established connection despite big gap of opinion and lifestyle as our vc sir has rightly inform about connectivity you should not disconnect with anybody you should not disconnect with anybody because of your status because of that individual status mishra ji maybe today is a fourth semester student and his colleague may become uh, selected in ifs mishra ji may become selected in uh, ias but he should they should not disconnect themselves from each other that may be i he may be ifs you may be ias you may be from tamil nadu cadre and that ifs may be posted in uh, foreign affairs ministry but you should not disconnect yourself from each from each other so that is the public relations thing maybe his birthday maybe his name in the newspaper maybe your name in the newspaper you should be connected with the established contact whatever contact are available established contact maybe 5 years back maybe 10 years back but you should not disconnect or discard that contact maybe it may not be useful to you today it may not be useful to you for another 10 years but that contact should not be discarded at all that is the sign of good public relations as well as good manager he has skill means basic knowledge and interaction of all if a manager want to perform in assam he must have proper skill to handle the basic knowledge of assam's geography assam's environment assam rain condition and if a manager posted it say kutch just opposite to another part of our country he must be have you must have basic knowledge of the desert of kutch human beings way of life of kutch and if he can connect with the local with his public relations skill no one can defeat his performance whether this person is posted in this thing being a logistic person he may be posted in kandla port trust for to handle logistic of uh, sea and tomorrow he may be posted in uh, jagi road to handle the fish market and fish go down of the jagi road he must be connected with local people he must be connected with all to perform and progress his own work if he doesn't connect with the thing he may not be successful despite his very professional academic knowledge but he is not connecting to the people concerned people he may not be successful in his uh, thing 
and another thing connectivity interaction interaction is a, also a must if i am planning to come to from dibrugarh to sipsagar uh, university and i had hired one uh, taxi i must interact with the driver i must not become a babu and sit beside him and uh, in a sleeping condition and when I, i should not say him that please tell me when university will come i will just uh, open my eyes no that is not the way you should interact in a proper way interact in a such a way that you should know the current situation available at that particular moment at that particular place and which may be favorable to you which may not be favorable to you which may be good for you you which may not be good for you it which may not be good for your health it may not be good good for your it may be good for your health but connectivity interaction is a must this is respectful way of life if a public relations person is mauni baba if he is not speaking properly if he is not intermingling with anyone properly despite good designation despite good qualification despite good family background despite good financial condition despite all good condition if he is not having a respectable lifestyle he, people will not encourage him as a encouraging personality if a person is attending some gathering with very high quality of his uh, say performance his designation but he is not connecting with the nature by nature if he is not connecting to the people people will not gather around him despite all his good qualities despite all his rich everything rich people will not gather around him so public relations person is a individual where people will come and gather around him if you say example of uh, sugar if one sugar caste is there you may have very big crowd of ant so because of sweet quality of the sugar so sweetness is a must for the public relations person or the any manager but is a public if you apply as a managerial skill in pub, uh, with public relations thing sweetness is a must alertness is a must so it, it now we will take some appearance and without artificial exemption what is appearance i am not talking about specialized communications like style communications but appearance appearance means a person wherever he is whenever it is it may be night 12 o'clock it may be morning 5 o'clock if you are meeting me at the brigade airport or if you are meeting me at tinsukia railway station or if you are meeting me at jorat state transport bus stop my appearance should be the same my response should be the same my alertness should be the same it should not you should not say that uh, yes i gentleman i was just sleeping and i you came here uh, i may not be able to receive your phone if you are not able to receive your his response you should say very frankly that i am very much tired because of my journey 
प्लीज आई मे नॉट प्लीज एक्सक्यूज मी आई मे नॉट बी जस्टिफाई आवर मीटिंग प्रॉपरली बट इफ यू आर मीटिंग हिम एंड हिज एंथ्यूसियाजम यू आर कन्वर्टिंग हिज एंथ्यूसियाजम इन अ डिस्करेजमेंट that is not the quality of public relations person that is not the quality of a manager of course some manager do that because of egoistic nature but as a public relations person you should not behave like that it is again again telling it is 24 by 7 alertness so another thing i have already mentioned about connectivity you should and again mention about unfriendliness unfriendliness is a little bit uh, again two steps ahead of it but ignorance you despite knowing them properly despite knowing the crowd properly and despite knowing individual properly should not try to ignore with artificial ego if you do it that is not good public relation gesture if you don't have sufficient time to uh, justify your meeting you should again i am repeating it frankly inform that it is not possible for me to justify our meeting but don't ignore and don't try to say that you have not seen him don't try to because it is nor you have two eyes they have also more than two eyes so don't try you should pr person should not try to ignore anyone and pr person should not try to try to uh, or let the uh, failure if failure is there it is okay if you involve entire group in your failure your failure will be your experience if you perform in a winning condition single handedly then your failure will become your multiple defeat i have already told it again i am telling it if you don't perform it it is okay if it is a failure it is okay but involve everyone so if you involve everyone your failure will become good experience for the organization good experience for the all performer and good experience for yourself also pr skill means you should not surrender to the provocative language of anybody provocative language means suppose for example for i can give my example only suppose i am having a wide beard and someone may not like my performance may not like my any quality or one of my quality so he may try to concentrate on my wide beard and if i come into trap of that wide beard means i may not be able to justify my lecture in the university my mind will concentrate myself in the beard so i may be of thinking that should i continue with my beard should i discontinue my beard should i have clean shaved should i have beard means i have lost my professional track so any and it is a part of the game for any human being that they will try to disconnect you from your task they try to discredit you from your task so 
it is a part of the game so you you should be very clear in your thoughts you should be very clear in your mind that provocative language will not affect your task of the performance so peer again peer thing skill means you should not jump into someone's task and you should not jump with the guidance and assistance of someone because if you fail because you are you fail because of them but they blame comes on you so be judicious when you want to perform don't follow someone for your own task don't take guidance for your performance your proper performance your ability your weakness it is individual thing someone may not have my hidden we may not be knowing about my hidden weakness someone may not be knowing about my hidden good quality hidden qualities so don't jump on someone guidance for the unknown task if you want to perform any task you should be very clear about the result of that task and the defeat of that task and success of that task you should not blame someone else for that yes organization may it's a part of the organizational strategy that one manager may pass on defeat to another manager another another manager may pass on his success to his superior or his junior it depends upon the quality of the manager but as a public relations skill you should use your individual quality as an individual you should not intermingle your quality with someone else you should not even steal someone else quality for your favor because someone else quality may not be uh, say um, compatible to you so if we use window 11 in thinkpad laptop it may not be compatible so it again either your laptop will shut down or your window 11 will not work so you should use your compatibility as a first thing a public relations person yeah of course cunning manager can perform in such a way that he can take good quality of someone and apply it to someone and bad quality of someone and apply it to someone but as a public relations individual you should perform particularly very particular about applying your own qualities so this is the thing i have noted down so many other things also but i don't know whether i have justified my lecture or not but anyway uh, please come with your question come with interaction so we can share you I, you people are more knowledgeable me than me because uh, i am old school individual in when i was studying uh, in general, in public relations we were only have one channel that is dd india and only one radio that is all india radio now the, you are having so many radio channels you are having so many uh, that thing and uh, when i was a student landline telephone was a tough task now everyone is having digital communications 
and we, we were not using uh, credit card we have no we had not when we were student we had not seen credit card so you people are more knowledgeable than us you are new school people i am old school people and i have tried uh, to provide you my personal experiences my personal uh, whatever personal gain from various interaction personal uh, reading and practical experiences so come with uh, your question and my phone number uh, is already available with you so anytime uh, you can uh, you are welcome for the professional interaction you are always welcome please come with uh, please start knowledge sharing exercise yeah, i have start i have done my uh, this is a one way traffic it is not a communications now start communications Thank Can we have questions from the participants? Now this is two way communications. Start communications. Sir, uh, we Sir, have... do like to say that PR person has to compromise with a lot of things. Am I audible? Yeah, sir. Please. I uh, do like to say that PR person has to compromise with a lot of things. Hmm. You should have a compromising personality. Sir, your uh, voice dis got disconnected. Please uh, come near to the mic. Sir, do you like to say that PR person has to compromise with a lot of things, and he should have a compromising personality? Am I audible? but i could not get your question do you mean to say that pr person has to compromise with a lot of things and she he or she should have compromise, a compromise no 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 not compromise compromise not compromise personal compromise not compromise in the in the principle ethical thing cannot be compromised exactly ha ethical things cannot be compromised even if you are getting the best public relation that i could not cover it i had written it ethical things cannot be compromised professional things also cannot be compromised if any if you if you say if you are working in a particular tv channel and if you ethically you may not be able to cover that thing means you may not be able to cover that thing If ethically no public relations person should compromise anything ethical is a basic practice transparency is a basic practice which i have not covered it transparency how i have not covered it but transparency it is a very basic thing you should not compromise on your transparency that's what i have told uh, i have covered it a little bit in a different way failure you should not compromise ethically no ethical compromise no ethical compromise thank you sir uh, sir we question from ashrafur rahman so yeah. he is asking how pr is different from communication is it necessary to be diplomatic for a pr person public relations is a old school now it is is a communications thing communications is a current word earlier it used to be a public relations but uh, communications is a must and diplomatic public relations individual skill is a diplomatic thing you should be diplomatic in all respect whatever i have told it is a all diplomacy in word word it is a diplomacy yes how you can apply it it is another matter like i i, I forgot to mention about ethical practice 
unfortunately gosab has uh, correctly point, pointed out the ethical practice but diplomatic thing it is a pr is a diplomatic thing communications diplomatic communications is a public relations you should be communicate in a such a way that you are not you you are converting everything in a win win situation that is the communication skill otherwise what is wrong with if a manager want to perform in a one way way that this is the rule i want to perform with this rule so that is not diplomatic he should be diplomatic in his way so that is public relations and whenever you must have uh, observe in your day to day life that despite your disagreement you are doing the thing which have been asked to do that how are you are doing it because of diplomatic correct communications Say lockdown. Suppose I may not be able to go to this particular place because of lockdown. No, lockdown is meant for the good health of us. So that it that is the right communications, and that is lockdown. Otherwise, that is jail. if you are if you see any jail prisoner can he say that i am very happy in jail no because he was not communicated properly <clears throat> we have we have been communicated properly that it is the lockdown is meant good for you that is diplomatic communications and we have enjoyed lockdown we have perform our job online so that is diplomatic and favorable communications if you if anyone say that to, tomorrow you will not go go outside we put lock because you are virus affected no it is not like that it is like that that you should not go outside because you may affect your health as well as someone else health that is diplomatic communications for the uh, micro containment so that is the way of life and if i convey like that that because of i am affected with that particular virus i must not go outside and affect someone else who is healthy enough so that is good communications and if someone tell that you should be you are virus affected so we will close your door you die or that we don't bother that is not good communications i think i have thank you sir your question properly yes sir thank you amanji Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, am I clear? Yes, sir. You are clear. Thank you. So, are there any other questions from the participants? So again, I am telling ethical practice is a must for anything, whether it is a public relations thing, whether it is a communications, whether it is a advertising whether it is a film if you don't follow ethical practice ultimately a person who is not following ethical practice will be in trouble one day or other because unethical practice will not survive for entire world for entire life unethical practice can survive for some people for some day it is not for every people for every day for all years to for all people 
so again i am sorry ghost sir i could not mention ethical practice and i have no matlab i don't say anything prs no compromise prs not to compromise for anything not to compromise for individual thing not to compromise that is the pr quality but yes <clears throat> you have to perform in a compromising way in a, in that way that everybody will be your follower you should compromise in a such a way that without compromising ethical practice means everyone will be involved in that way you should not rigid to anything non compromising means not rigid to anything thank you uh, sir sir we have a asking for question uh, yes sir it is from akash ji philodori he is asking mm -hmm. is it good for a manager to sacrifice or compromise to uplift its subordinates no need of compromise no need of uh, sacrifice why for what you should perform in it such a way that you should not compromise anything you should not sacrifice anything why should, why should you should sacrifice anything if you take per sub sufficient step with proper uh, guidelines and structured uh, vision you should not sacrifice yourself yes you should perform for your company and your company is not telling you to sacrifice your thing no you should perform in a such a way that your company will gain it and that is the public relations everybody will gain it not only you not only your company everybody will gain it that is the way of public relations it is not to, uh, to defeat someone and to one someone it is not that you should be, you should defeat this one and you should uh, one uh, you yourself one the thing no public relations is a thing it is a win win situation it is a win win situation why you should sacrifice what you should you you will sacrifice what you will sacrifice for example what is what is the sacrifice yes you should sacrifice your time yes it is a must 24 by 7 you should be alert you should sacrifice your time nothing wrong in it if you are performing for your company you should sacrifice your time no problem Uh, sir, uh, yes, sir, uh, uh, we have another question from Kaushik Gogoi. Ah. So he is asking, what are the disadvantages of public relations? Public disadvantages of public relations is uh, it is twenty four by seven job. It is twenty four by seven job. That is disadvantage. You cannot whether you are in a mood or no. whether you are you want to do that or no but yes you have to perform matlab you have to perform in a best way for the organize for the sake of the organization two question i can see yes please mishra ji uh, sir we have another question from ashraf rahman hmm. so he is asking how to use pr skills effectively in an organization mncs how to so how to use pr skills effectively in an organization mncs yeah pr skill in fact each individual of the organization is a public relations individual of the company each individual should consider himself herself as a public relations individual of the company i can give you the example mr asapur rahman ji <clears throat> you are representing now uh, this cooperative university and if you are going to, to somewhere and you introduce that you are a student of this university 
means you are public relations person of that university next door neighbor will judge your university with your behavior means each individual of this each individual of the company is the public relations person of the company each individual of the society is public relations person of the society each individual of the state is public relations person of the state each individual of this country is public relations person of the country so each individual is a public relations person and each individual's responsibility to use that public relations uh, skill for the good of our uh, society for the good of the organization for the good of the state for the good of the nation another question was also there yes sir it is from lina so she is asking how can i remain effectively pr for the organization how okay. can so how can i remain effectively pr for the organization effective public relations means you should be alert of the question you should be, should be alert of the reply if you are not alert if you are not alert about your company you cannot give proper reply from your company so if you want to become best public relations person of the company first of all you must know best of the company and if you if you know the best of the company if you if you can uh, reproduce it in a best way it is the best public relations practice am i clear could you hear me yes sir you are audible pritam are yes. there any questions are there any questions from the participants no i was asking that for uh, question that that uh, uh, my answer was clear or not yeah please come yes sir it's very clear thank you okay so we have another question from tritok bora so he is asking how important is it now for the organization to impart good pr skills for all its employees good pr skill for the employees means good positive behavior from all it is a practice it, it is it is public relations is academic as well as practical thing if i behave properly my subordinate behave properly if i behave properly with my boss my subordinate will behave properly with me and his subordinate with will behave properly with him and public relations task is ethical practice no hidden agenda transparency is a must when public relations failure comes it is because of contradictory hidden agenda because of that many uh, person say that uh, i am not satisfied with this thing i am not satisfied with this thing because of contradictory sermons from two different thing so if transparency is there no contradiction even if it is a contradiction it is a transparent way even if it is a contra contradictory way it is a transparent way so even if it is a contradiction if it is in a transparent way no one will object that contradiction yeah another question was coming uh, sir it is from rahul hussain he is asking does pr hamper organization secrecy organization secrecy and transparency you see it is a very thin line so organization secrecy 
there is nothing like um, best practice in a transparent way, in a good way. And organizational secret, it is a, you have to follow the organization strict secret in a transparent way. No one will say that uh, you should uh, open the uh, gold uh, coins uh, almira of organization and op uh, guide them to, to for the key of the or uh, that golden key almira. No. But yes, you must be aware of the secrecy of the organization. And you should be very frank that it is a secret thing. We may not be in a position to compromise on that secrecy. Nothing wrong in it. Frankly telling it. We don't know. I will ask to my boss. I, my boss will ask to his boss. No, that is not the way. Secrecy is a secrecy. Transparency is a transparency. Very transparent way. You can boldly and frankly inform that, yes, it is a secret thing. We may not be able to part with that secrecy. No problem. Secrecy is a secrecy. Transpar in a transparent way, you should say that it is a secret thing. We, we, we will not compromise with that secret thing with you. That is the way. Is it okay? Yes, sir. Thank you. Okay. Uh, are there any other questions from the participants? Uh, sir, uh, there is one another question from Syed Par uh, Parvez, sir. Mm. So he is asking how PR practice can be enhanced, especially in government offices. PR practice can be enhanced in government offices. Uh, I, I don't know the situation all of all government offices, but PR practice in government offices is definitely currently enhancing its practice by newspaper uh, awareness, uh, advertisement awareness, by digital media awareness, by broadcasting awareness, and uh, all types, all tools of public relations. Government media is uh, using it. If uh, you say, I am not a spokesperson of the government, but uh, yes, as a citizen of the country, I must say that vaccination task is a very big public relations exercise of the government. It's a, India is a, such a big country spread over from hill to desert, from uh, forest to mainland. But successfully completed vaccination awareness program. Now, if someone might not have taken vaccination, it is okay. It is individual thing that I have taken first dose, I have taken second dose, I have taken precaution dose. It is individual priority that he may take today, he may take after six days. But in India, currently, no one will say that I don't know about vaccination. Can you say that? No. Can you say any anyone of the country? I don't know. You can ask, at least I am just assured that no one will say that I am. I don't know about vaccination. So that is good public lessons exercise of the government. So, so, so oh, yes, uh, sir. So, please continue. Sorry, sir. No, no, no problem. Please. Second uh, question sir, is also there. Uh, yes, sir. So, it is from Vini Dhawan. So, she is asking can PR be misused and how to prevent debt as a manager? 
fear can be misused that is what i have told that arrogance and artificial ego should be avoided and management should be rest assured that his pr will will not be misused and second thing if ethical pr is there no one will misuse it what is that if it is a open thing misuse can be possible only if have have had got and have not have not so then only it can be misused otherwise how can public relations can be misused no public relations may not be misused as per my opinion the if it is open thing open transparent and ethical open transparent and ethical thing cannot be misused yes if i have anyone had performed an ethical thing in a public relations way it can be misused with ethical practice no ethical practice and transparent way it can not cannot be misused can you have can can i have example of misuse of the public relations madam do you have any example of misuse of the public relations transparent ethical public relations cannot be misused that is my perception transparent ethical public relations cannot be misused it is open thing and openness open transparent thing cannot be misused by anybody if you uh, convey properly it cannot be misused yes if i cannot convey it properly it can be misused like a uh, gossa has uh, recently asked about compromise thing it is my fault that i could not convey the compromise thing properly so that can be misused but ethical practice in a transparent way cannot be comprom- cannot be misused and if you don't Uh, compromise any ethical practice it cannot be misused what they people can misuse right if something wrong is uh, there people can misuse that wrong if you correct thing is there what people have will misuse that correct thing no i don't think so if you have example please tell me if you remember that example in future please tell me i will try to um, a clear my thought also misuse of public relations i have not heard it so far misuse of public relations practice but i will just learn about it nothing wrong in it uh so we have another question from pallab jyoti bhattacharya mm. so he is asking how is pr different from advertising pr different from advertising advertising is a specific commercial purpose target oriented commercial purpose it is not sustainable thing it is it is not expected to per, uh, sustainable public relations is a sustainable thing ever sustainable thing whether you have target audience or not whether you have any uh, any gain or not but public relations is there advertising is a with specific thing with specific purpose with specific gain no public relations is not meant for it it is not meant for commercial thing public relations is advertising is a definitely commercial thing advertising definitely is a target oriented thing advertising is definitely with specific purpose thing no public relations is not meant for it public relations is a sustainable permanent thing sir may i add one more point that advertising is one way communication whereas public relations is a two way communication public relations is a two way communication whereas yeah. advertising is a one way communication 
yes it? It, it is it is a it is a it is target oriented one way communications and pr is a sustainable multi way communications not only two way sir it is a multi way communications right sir thank you. sir uh, there is another question from ashraf rahman so he is uh, willing to add to parvez sir's question that how would you uh, advise public sector banks to enhance pr Public this sector. will be the last question, uh, Pritam. This yes, shall be the last question. Okay. Sure, ma'am. I don't represent bank, so I should not speak about bank. But yes, as a citizen of the country and as a public relations profession, I again repeat the thing that public relations of the banks each. Employee of the bank is a public relations person. Not only chairman, not only public relations officer of the bank, not only branch manager, not only cashier, not only check clearance individual, not only attendant. Each individual of the banking organization is a public relations person. If he, he, any individual of that that organization. is bad in communications it will affect the entire organization suppose i give the example if i go to atm counter and if atm is not working and that chokidar of the atm may not be able to give me proper answer that when that atm machine will be available for me to perform the job if he is not available if he is he doesn't know the answer means his public relations to me as a citizen is not good he has not satisfy satisfactory answer for me so each individual is a public relations individual of the bank each individual who is working for the bank he is responsible for good result and good public relations practice uh, sir there is a last question from uh, janab kaur sir sir he is asking that if uh, a peer manager resigns from the organization and mm -hmm. he or she chooses uh, to make those information public and this is da damaging the image of the con company now if i am appointed as a new pr manager then how should i deal uh, with the situation first of all there is no such secret public relations person is supposed to know which public may not be aware public relations individual task is to inform the public about the, the good thing of the company and yes it is the uh, not only public relations individual any disgruntled employee can spoil the image of the company any disgruntled employee why public relations even attendant even uh, even um, say sweeper even say housekeeping individual that is the thing see if companies having ethical practice in a transparent way if an individual leave the company he may not spoil the image of the company because company's image is a standard image standard practice in if it is a good image if it is a structured image if it is a structured ethical image no one can disturb that image with one or two individual disgruntled enemy disgruntled individual disgruntled employee disgruntled anything if you say the image of the our country can you say anybody no because it is a structured transparent 
ethical image created since thousands of thousands of thousands of years so many people come and go many discontent enemy enemy dis sorry discontent individual may come and go but it will not affect the structured ethical image created by the organization it will not affect it is not possible to affect if it is a ethical transparent way that image is created in a ethical transparent way yes if it is if it is artificial image it can individual can damage it but if it is an ethical ethically created image no one can disturb it thank you so much sir it was great interacting with you uh, so uh, so we have come to the end of this session so i would like to thank our honorable vice chancellor sir professor deborah das sir respected uh, speaker sri kashyap chashipura sir coordinator of the webinar dr rashida tahira nurin ma'am faculty members of assam rajiv gandhi university of cooperative management and all the participants so i extend uh, my gratitude to you and to all the uh, participants and i uh, and uh, thank you so much sir for giving us uh, time from your busy schedule so i must also thank uh, the organizing team uh, for working hard uh, for the past few days to make this webinar successful and i also thank all the participants for the active participation in the webinar and making it a grand success thank you everyone for uh, making this session a grand success and so uh, we expect uh, more sessions with you so that we can interact uh, more uh, with you and we can clear our uh, doubts and also increase our knowledge in the field thank you so much sir thank you so much for providing me an opportunity thank you vice chancellor sir thank you rashida madam thank you mishra ji and thank you gosh sir for pointing out so many professional things to me thank you so much and thank you so much to all questioner all persons who have questioned so many good questions to me it is a very good knowledge sharing exercise and uh, yes if anything i could not explain it properly please uh, pointing point it out to me that this is this was no, this was little bit confusing your sentence because of uh, uh, some linguistic barrier because of uh, some uh, uh, professional barrier because of some uh, digital barrier sorry not professional digital barrier uh, it is a web barrier so uh, for that matter i am very sorry but thank you so much for uh, this knowledge sharing exercise uh, created by rasida madam mishra ji and thank you very much uh, das sab for uh, providing uh, this platform to all the students and all the students uh, we i wish festive greetings to all i wish all the success to you i wish all the happy bihu happy ramzan and uh, happy all festive occasions thank you so much thank you so thank much you sir thank you so much sir thank you so much sir thank you so much sir thank you thank you sir we can now close down the session and participants can log out